Ooh, do you remember that trip? Ooh, that's a good video idea. Man, yesterday was a really lazy day. As I'm writing my journal, I was able to observe my thoughts that I've never done before. Especially in times when things get busy. I tend to forget to live in the present. My mind would take me back to my past experience or would even take myself to the future. You guys, when things get busy, I'm like everywhere. I am like distracted. I am very distracted. I'll be here, I'll be there. I'm playing different scenarios in my head. And, and sometimes if these things get out of control, you know, I'll be, I don't feel like doing anything. I feel like staying home. I don't want to socialize. But by writing what's on my mind, I was able to separate my thoughts and the reality because sometimes our brain trick us like for example if we're constantly worrying even though this thing hasn't happened yet we think that it's gonna happen which eventually it's gonna happen if you know what I mean for me sometimes I'm, I'm also a victim of this where I'm playing the what-if scenario, for example, like being a perfectionism, when I'm writing my essay, I would be, rather than turning it in on time, sometimes in my mind, I feel like this is not good enough and this would lead me not submitting the essay at all. But by writing, by writing the situation that I have, for example, if I'm really sad, I'm happy, I'm not in the mood of doing anything, was able to evaluate these thoughts, to challenge actually them, if, if these are real or not. And what can I do? Like, you know, is this gonna happen? Is there, you know, asking different questions about these thoughts. I never thought about it before, like challenging my thoughts. But now, I challenge them rationally and emotionally. Oh, so emotional. But not all morning are like this. In a good morning, my mind would be in a constant flow of ideas. Suddenly, random things start to make connection. I was able to sketch plans and goals which focuses on productive things. Which I think is a good idea, guys. Because if you're trying to create something, if you write those ideas, and you go back, you can build another idea out of that idea that you write down, that you wrote down. And sometimes my journal would also be a blank page, but I think it's good. Well, I forced myself to think this time. And I think this is also the time, this is also the time I spend my time reflecting back on my previous days to see what I'm doing good, what I'm doing bad, what are the things that I need to improve on, or sometimes Congratulate my congratulate myself for doing developing for keeping up the good habits that you're trying to achieve trying to keep uh, Trying to keep which is pretty good. Although this might take um, 30 minutes to an hour writing your thoughts every day every morning at the very beginning of your day But I think it's very beneficial and I think you should give it a try As I finish Writing my journal in the morning with a fresh start and new ideas, I am ready to tackle the day.